What's going on YouTube, Mr. 1013 here with another review and this time we're going to check out Shipment 2 from the Figure, subscri figure Subscription 3.0. Um, just got mine in today, this afternoon, got home, cracked them open, time to do a review. Um, we're going to check out uh, Swamp Fighter Muskrat. He came along with Slice from the Ninja Force. I can't wait to get to, to that review, you guys know how I feel about Ninja Force. Uh, just the holy grail of my uh, sub teams, but <laughs> here we go. Muskrat. We had a version of Muskrat come in the 2013 um, Joe Kahn set, Night Force, and um, this is basically a repaint in his original color wave. Um, so we're gonna do a little bit of comparison from the Night Force version to your um, a raw version, original colorway or whatever, and I'm gonna let you guys know which one, which version I like the best. But here's um, Muskrat with his original card art, GI Joe Club exclusive. Let's get a look at the back of this card. Get out a good pause so you can get the read up on Muskrat. And as you can see right there is uh, three of three, um, figure subscription three, uh, third figure. That's what that means on there. So, here we go. Muskrat came with some nice accessories. He basically came with the, uh, the same like blade, knife, and um, I think that's it. That it came with the knife for a set, but let's just get into it. Got a nice little shotgun right here. A sniper rifle. Also came with his machete. A bear trap. Has a little bit of articulation on there. And he comes with uh, his backpack. Now we didn't see this like in the original mock-ups that he would have this little backpack, but this this looks really good. I like that um, they added this accessory um, for Muskrat. But there that is, and it matches the little uh the little board right here. Like wakeboard, surfboard, whatever this thing is. But nice, very nice paint apps on it. This did not come with the Night Force version. So it was kind of dope that they added this to it. Got some nice detail, nice texture on there. Paint apps pretty solid. It does not have peg holes on the bottom, so it doesn't go on his stand. Like um, for instance, the um skis of snow job so you just have to place it on there which is which kind of sucks but uh yeah it does have does not have any peg holes on there so he could fall off uh the stand kind of unfortunate but there we go take a look at muskrat comes with his gi joe stand code name muskrat let's take a closer look and here he is Very nice paint job on him. Hat does come off. Let's take that off while I get to the articulation. I'm glad that fell in the box. <clears throat> but yeah, like I said, basically a repaint from the Night Force version. And I want to add this too. This knife does come off, so he does have um some good web gear that can some, that can holster everything. And then this is so dope. Um, this was actually on the Night Force version, but I didn't. I didn't ever um, have him posing with this pistol, but the silencer does go right here in this holster, right in the front leg, and the pistol in the back. This is like beyond, I mean, it's like I said, this is on the Night Force version, but beyond him, i never seen that that kind of holster on any of the figures. So that, that's, that's kind of sweet. I can appreciate that. On this side, just have some pouches. There we go. So again, I mean, I like this figure from when um he was in the convention set, same head sculpt and everything. Um, so I I wasn't disappointed when getting him again, uh, but just in his original colorway. Um, articulation, standard articulation, head side to side, up and down, arms go out, bend at the elbow, spin at the elbow, spin at the wrist, no hinged wrist articulation, uh, <clears throat> waist articulation. Um, ab crunch is there slightly with the vest on here. Legs go out. 
double jointed knees, foot pivots, and spins. So let's get a quick comparison. And this is going to be a hard one, man, because I actually kind of, I mean, as I just did this review or just looking at this uh, this figure while I got him in hand, he actually, I mean, it's going to be hard to decide which one I like better versus um, the Night Force in the original colorway. I'm getting back on the stand now. So here we have the figure subscription muskrat. And we have the Night Force muskrat. This is kind of tough, man. Um, I mean, I like I like the Night Force muskrat because of the metallic blue paint jobs. He has more uh, diverse colors as far as like the blacks, the the um, like swamp green with the neon with the metallic blue. This one just mainly greens. Um, only different green is on his shirt, on his, on his tank top in here. But both and basically like his legs, vest, hat, everything are his boots are basically the same um color green. So uh with that being said, I, I think uh it's gonna be a hard decision. I, I think it's gonna go with the night force version this time around because I like I said, I like the the colorway. I like more colors. I, I mean it's only one added color, but it makes such a difference. And um, I just I just like this version better. I like the straps. I mean, you could just see more detail here with the different paint apps versus here. So I'm gonna have to give it to the Night Force Muskrat this time around. Again, both solid solid figures. Period. Just a solid character, solid build um, for what the club did. But uh, it goes to Night Force. Get him out the way. There you have it, guys. Muskrat from the figure, subscri figure subscription 3.0. Um, be sure to check your mailbox if you hadn't got yours today. Um, they started shipping out last Friday. I would have got, I probably would have got mine yesterday too, but we got some bad snow. Um, we got like 16 inches in like on the span of 24 hours. So I'm in Michigan and they said we're getting some more. But besides that, thanks again for the 400 plus subscribers. I'll talk to you on the next review. Share, like, and subscribe. Talk to you later. Peace.